Can we just take a moment, everybody, to... I'm so excited. We're getting proper. We're doing a full English breakfast challenge. It's game time. Or should I say, it's breakfast time. What is going on everybody, Eric the Electric, come back to you guys again with another video, or should I say, cheerio. Because in this video, everybody, we're getting proper. We're doing a full English breakfast challenge. Here's the thing though, everybody, that Costco challenge last week absolutely wrecked me. Yeah, I just really don't want to even look at this right now. But I was able to crush an awesome bike ride. Whew. And let's just say my appetite is finally back. Before we jump into this crazy food challenge, everybody, I'm doing something a little bit different. I'm gonna weigh myself before and after this challenge. So here's my little pre-challenge weigh-in. All right, everybody, so a little pre-challenge weigh-in and a little pre-challenge physique check for you guys right now. Physique check. So now you guys know my pre-challenge weight. I want you guys to take a guess down below how much you guys think I'm gonna gain in this challenge. If you guys guess it right, you might just get a heart from me. But you guys gotta stay tuned to the end of the video to find out. Now without further ado folks, it's time to go get our ingredients. How you doing? Um, I'm looking for um, black pudding and blood sausage. Yeah, sure. That's one pound right there? Yeah. Perfect, I'm gonna get one of those. Yep, nice. have a good day. Oh, the grocery store, my favorite place. A 12 pound block of cheese. Who wants to see a giant cheese challenge? Comment down below. Alrighty guys, so we have all of our delicious items. Now it's time to start cooking. It's game time. Or should I say, it's breakfast time. Oh come on. We're about to get our hands dirty. And plus I, I'm a very messy person. So we're gonna need the apron. For my first time ever trying blood pudding, this is gonna be interesting. So sick. I'm actually pretty stoked about this. There's one more thing we're missing. The beans. Tomato sauce. Probably should have drained these. It's like the lunch lady right now. Oh my goodness gracious. It's also tea time. Yorkshire tea. Let's have a proper brew. And already, Electric Empire, can we just take a moment, everybody, to... 
I'm so excited. Okay, I know everybody that's watching this that's over in the UK right now that's had a traditional English English breakfast before you guys are probably looking at this and you're going, yeah, way to go, dude. Right. Have the real one. You suck, Eric. Your cooking skills suck. Whatever. Whatever it is, everybody. I'm not a chef. And everyone, when it comes to making these giant creations, I usually, it usually fails, okay? But I'm proud of myself, all right? I'm proud of myself, everyone. We have a traditional, or my take on a traditional English breakfast right here, and I couldn't be any more excited to bring this to you guys. I've been wanting to do this for a long time, and you know what, everyone? It's, I haven't gone across to the UK to actually eat one of these in the UK, but maybe one day I will. Everyone, this is a massive English breakfast right here, folks. We have 10 eggs, one pound of blood sausage, which I've never had before. I'm very curious to try. We have two pounds of potatoes, one pound of bacon, sauteed mushrooms, which no one actually probably will care about, two cans of beans, six slices of butter toast, and even some healthy vegetables. If you guys have been around for a while now, if you've seen a few videos of mine, you guys will know that I absolutely Love, 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 love breakfast. It's my absolute favorite type of food to eat. With that being said, Electric Empire, I think we're ready to get this challenge started and we are ready to, we're not ready to get it started. I forgot something very, very important. Very, 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 very important. How could I forget? Just in case, okay? Just in case we're gonna need it, which probably will need it. Anyways, now that that's out of the way, let's chicken power. We are ready to get this challenge started and we are ready to get this one underway. But before we do though, I gotta let you guys know the total calories that are in this challenge. Those are gonna be listed like right there for you guys. And total macros, that means protein, carbs, fat. Total macros are gonna be listed like right there for you guys. Without further ado, my friends, my family, members of the Electric Empire, this is the all American English breakfast challenge. Let's do this. Already right, Electric Empire, we are ready to get this challenge started. We are ready to get this one underway. I'm so excited, I love breakfast. Breakfast is amazing, it's the most important meal of the day. I don't care what anybody says, okay? Wow, this is gonna be good. Anyways, before we get it started though, Electric Empire, just like always, you guys gotta give the video a like. If you poop today. And also, you guys are probably wondering why I have a random jar of Cadbury milk chocolate spread over here. I saw it in the store, and Cadbury always reminds me of the UK. So I decided to, you know, include it in this challenge, and you know, we'll probably end up using this on some of our toast. Oh my goodness gracious. That looks magnificent. We're gonna start with our veggies first. All right, Electric Empire, it's time to get this English breakfast challenge started. Let's do this. It's a tomato. <laughs> There's no way I'm gonna give that one a fire. I mean, hey, at least we're getting the least eventful thing out of the way first. Let's do this in party. Now I just wanna get into the first potato. Okay, here's the thing. Chips versus fries. We call them fries here. These, I'm just gonna call these chips because this is an English breakfast challenge, okay? It is what it is. Tastes proper. All right, guys, well, so far, so good. Good thing we're getting our complex carbs in. No! I hate when that happens. You guys know what's crazy? My first ever food challenge was a breakfast food challenge. I ended up setting a record at that location. It was crazy. I can't believe that was late. That was like seven years ago. <sighs> All right guys, well, the potatoes are all down. I'm not gonna say, I'm not gonna say it just because I made them, but those are actually really, really good. I'm glad they weren't like six pounds of hash browns, which came on my last breakfast challenge that I did in Canada all those months ago. Wow, that was, ooh. Uh, I think we gotta just get into the protein, everybody. We gotta, we gotta do this blood sausage. Everyone, I've heard that blood sausage really is just an acquired taste. I mean, honestly, everybody just look at it. It doesn't really look that appealing we don't really have access to it here in the u.s but i found out a way to get some we're including it in this challenge hold up one second i gotta add some tea cleanse my palate here for proper sip of tea i wish it was coffee but it's okay 
there's just certain people out there, okay? If you're a coffee person, you're a coffee person. If you're a tea person, you're a tea person, okay? I realize that people in the UK probably drink both coffee and tea. But I'm showing you guys in this video over in the UK some love, okay? Because I love you guys and I hope to come visit you someday. Anyways, everyone, it's time to get into the blood sausage. Here we go. Tastes like sausage. <laughs> I gotta say, it's actually, I, I, I actually kind of like it. I didn't think I would like it. It's just, it's kind of like a, I don't know how to describe it. It's, it's very rich. It's very rich for a sausage. Anyways, I actually kind of like the sausage. All right guys, well, our blood sausage is down. Now we got our actual sausages and we have our bacon right here. Now this is some thick, like thick, 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 like, T-H-I-C-C-C-C-C-C, thick bacon, not the bacon. All right guys, well, our bacon is all down. Now we gotta get to the rest of these sausages. And uh, you know what, let's just, while we're at it, let's just get this out of the way. You know, uh, traditionally, if you guys are wondering why I have mushrooms on this plate, I know every time I have a vegetable on a challenge, everyone's like, but apparently that's what comes with a traditional English breakfast. Anyways, get your veggies and people. Whew. All right guys, well, uh, we are almost 50, I would say we're actually probably more than 50% done with this. Now we gotta get over to these sausages. Sausages. <laughs> I'm not even gonna bother giving you guys my English accent because it's horrible, all right? It is, it is, it is horrible. Yeah, it's almost as horrible as my cooking skills. Anyways, we're gonna put some ranch on our sausages. I just wanna say everybody, I did not plan on using my hands for the majority of this challenge, but it just kind of worked out that way. All right guys, well, our sausage is down. Whew. We have our bread left, our eggs left, and our beans. Wow, they just don't really look that appetizing right now, but hopefully they will in a few seconds. Um, I think we're gonna get over to our bread next, but we gotta find a clever way to eat this bread. You guys know me. Everyone, if you missed it earlier, I put an insane amount of butter on this bread because apparently that's how the bread is eaten with traditional English breakfast. And you know what? We're gonna add some other additional, well, in this case, some other unnecessary calories to that bread. And we're just gonna put some, uh, some Cadbury spread on there just like so. Oh, I guess we got some, we got some ketchup on there. Oh well, salty and sweet, right? <laughs> Turn on that. Nibble that off. All right, here we go. Woo! W! Oh! Jungle! That is amazing! Goodness gracious! Wow. This stuff is absolutely insane. Wow. I really, really need to get the Goodness gracious. Egg sandwich. Oh, good, good, good. Wow. Okay, yoke down the <laughs> Oh, I don't remember why I should not save bread for last. I should have learned my lesson last week. All right, guys. Well, we have one, two, three, four eggs left, and then technically two slices of bread, and then lots of beans. All right, guys. Well, we have all of our eggs down now. It's time to get to our beans and uh, yeah, the rest of our bread. Bread, if you guys know, whenever I get to this point in the challenges, it's simply a vessel for bigger and better things like this. Simply a vessel. Simply a vessel. Man, good thing we're getting our healthy fiber in today.
Alright everybody, well, you guys are still full of video, but I need you guys to comment down below Electric Empire is proper, because I feel very, very proper right now. And also everybody, we're going to fast forward an hour or two away from now and I'll show you guys my final weight. Two hours later. Post challenge weigh in time. 184.1. Now everybody, let's finish this challenge. And just like that, Electric Empire. That has been another video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did enjoy the video, be sure to let me know down in the comments below, like always. Don't forget everybody, if you want to keep watching more Eric the Electric, be sure to check out my playlist down below. The party does not have to end here, everybody. Thanks again for watching the video, everybody. I'll see you guys next week.